Hansen are putting back across a muddy car park. Bob, you're up next. As a teenager, I used to terrorise my neighbourhood with a game I invented called Theft and Shrubbery. <laughs> what were the rules of theft and shrubbery? <sighs> Can I first of all say my memories of this are a bit sketchy? <laughs> Always handy for this game. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, but I'm, I'm, you know, I'm an, an, an older gentleman. They're more like just, you know, just fingerprints on an abandoned handrail. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just really insistent. Even while you poetically describe the ageing process, yeah. another part of your brain <laughs> is inventing the rules of a fiction. <laughs> And shrubbery. Yeah. It's a game that I played in my youth, in my teens, in um, on the Lakes Estate in Middlesbrough. I would probably be 14 or 15. Um, I hope that's all the information you need. <laughs> to what this game involved. <laughs> yes, of course. Of course. In which case, I'm satisfied and there's no need to tell them. <laughs> <laughs> what, what were the rules? Um, there would have to be a gang of you. I would usually be with um, Stava and Bagger. Um, <laughs> well, I didn't realise you knew hobbits as <laughs> <laughs> Neil Overall, a, a Jerry Dungaree's son, of course. He <laughs> didn't take his father's name. <laughs> hated yeah. him. Yeah. Hated yeah. him. So, and, but, and, and Gary Cheeseman would be there. So the reason he was called Cheesy is because his mum used to give him a cheese. Do you know the cheese slice? Yeah. yeah. To take out with him yeah. when we were hanging around the shops what? and that, because she wanted, because she thought it was good for a spot. <laughs> she wanted to slice. Surely it's because of his surname Cheeseman. No, no. <laughs> Surely that was part of it. <laughs> you know, Gary Cheeseman was a big lad, yeah? A very big head. Sniper's dream, they used to call him. <laughs> 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 oh, he's such a nice... The thing is, he's such a nice lad. And he was a... He was a... I love these points in the show where we say, Bob, let, let's all gather round the fireside. <laughs> of your youth. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, so, so the rules of the game. Of theft course you were not. Theft the rules shrubbery. of the game. Okay. Theft and... Shrubbery. 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 <laughs> <laughs> were relatively simple. You had to creep into the back of someone's house and observe the family watching the telly or whatever they're doing, yeah? It's getting a bit sinister now, Bob. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> is, this, is, is this at night? This is on the evening time, yeah. So, so the, the, the family is, as it were, backlit by the yes, domestic lighting. It's beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> and then you'd find one where the curtains were open, yeah? Go to the rear of the garden and then you'd slowly walk towards the window. <laughs> right? <laughs> Try not to disturb them. And you'd chant, increasingly increasing the, vo the uh, volume as you went, we do beg your pardon. <laughs> But we are in your garden. <laughs> <laughs> and then you gradually get closer and closer to the window, and as soon as you were seen, that's when shrubbery comes in. Which was what? You were not allowed to escape via the front of the property. You had to go across all the fences. Because you're teenagers, what you're really waiting for is someone to make a noise or give yourself away yeah. so that you all have to go run, run through all the gardens. That's the shrubbery That's part. That's the shrubbery What's part. What's the theft thing? part? The, the theft is, is... We just always felt that we were stealing something from them. Their privacy. Don't know, <laughs> their privacy, their dignity. Yeah. So you, you're going up the garden saying louder and louder, we do beg your pardon, <laughs> we are in your garden. <laughs> <laughs> Do beg your pardon. We are in the dark. You're shouting. How, how loud are how how loud loud you? People who are hard of hearing. <laughs> you can be going, we do beg your pardon. <laughs> we are in your garden. Before they notice it. <laughs> yeah. This game can't have lasted. I'm imagining very long before people kind of rumbled you and... No, it was just one of the games, you know, you, you, that we did. It could be um, theft and shrubbery night. There was another night where we used to take <laughs> fruit from um, a fruit vendor's wagon and throw that up in the air and just let it drop on our heads. Something <laughs> <laughs> tells me you play that quite a lot, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> next, time, next time, don't use melons. <laughs> Cheeseman was very good at it. <laughs> 
So what do you think, David? Steve, my, what do you my, think? My concern is that the details are so utterly believable and sound like they're real that if it wasn't actually a game, he spent an awful lot of time looking through people's windows. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm coming down on the, on the side of truth. Yeah, I know it sounds odd, but I just believe it. <laughs> You're going to say true? Yeah. OK, so, theft and shrubbery. Bob, truth or lie? I was telling the truth. <laughs> Round is called This Is 